Hello, I'm Theo, and in my three-minute paper presentation, I will be discussing a paper titled Swiss Admi, a free web tool to evaluate pharmacokinetics, drug likeness, and medicinal chemistry friendliness of small molecules. So in drug discovery, large numbers of compounds are often screened, and certain parameters uh, need to be evaluated in order to determine which of those screened molecules would have favorable pharmacokinetics in an organism. Uh, the most common descriptors of pharmacokinetics are absorption, distribution, metabolism, and excretion, uh, commonly known as ADME. Uh, often these are measured with uh, wet lab assays and in a more rigorous fashion, but when you have a large compound library or you're doing computational experiments, it's desirable to just do virtual screening. Uh, Swiss ADME is designed to be a user-friendly web server that enables the user to input a variety of molecular files for uh, drug likeness screening. For the screening of large libraries, the user can submit as many files as they desire. After uh, file submission and a brief waiting period, the user will receive the scores of each of the molecules they submitted in a large variety of categories. Uh, some important examples are of these categories are lipophilicity, water solubility, medicinal chemistry, and drug likeness. Uh, broadly speaking, lipophilicity refers to the ability of a substance to dissolve in lipids. Uh, in Swiss ADME and in others, uh, this is evaluated using uh, the partition coefficient between N-octanol and water. Uh, Swiss ADME uses many predictive methods for uh, lipophilicity, and one of which uh, is in a physics-based method that uh, estimates free energies of solvation in octanol and water and combines those results to yield a partition coefficient. Uh, a similar, uh, m more than one predictive method is also used for water solubility. Uh, and these are based on methods, actual predictive methods, that had correlations between uh, predicted and experimental values of uh, 0.69 and 0.81. Uh, this was deemed by the authors to indicate the external validity of Swiss ADME. Uh, potential promi potentially promiscuous or sticky molecules are also identified using a fragments database. Uh, this is also done for toxic compounds. So toxic or sticky moieties are identified in the fragments database and the user is alerted if any of their inputted molecules meet that criteria. Um, drug likeness screenings are conducted in Swiss ADME. Uh, these are based on molecular parameters like molecular weight, number of hydrogen bond acceptors, molar refractivity, and these are approximate screenings for bioavailability. So overall this server enables the user to conduct a highly efficient screening of compounds and in order to detect which ones are metabolically viable potentially and merit further consideration. Thank you.